All right, so let's check out the damage. We have things on fire. We got hit by missiles. So, okay. Actually, not too bad. Just we lost oxygen. We need to fix this up really quickly because we're going to lose all the oxygen in there. Right, we lost a little bit of oxygen. That's not too bad. And we lost a bit of the exoskeleton. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. My light ion scouts. It's a mess. And it had uranium in there, too. Ouch. All right, we're just going to take this one out. Ouch, ouch, ouch. So that's why I saw small flying bits <laughs> when I backed up it's because it was this the light iron scout all right so that's that's unfortunate um we have a bit of situation here I think we just use this right well we're gonna use this now to cover it up should have definitely used my shields <laughs> Although we didn't have much power, but I think we're okay. I think we lost the window here. Is this a window open? Yes, it is. Um, we can fix that. Not a big deal. I was definitely not expecting that whatsoever because there was such a delay in terms of being shot at when we got to 600. <laughs> We're close to 600. Luckily, aim for my light iron scout. So we definitely need to put some decoys elsewhere, but then we can get shot. So that can, it can aim for that instead of my ship. All right, so we're about a KOA. So let's charge up, put some stuff away, and get close to see what it's all about. I'm pretty sure there's Gatlins if there's missiles um, or missile launchers. So. We gotta be careful here. I'm gonna put a GPS pointer here just in case we don't see it for whatever reasons. Um, grab my rifle really quickly and we should be good to go. All right, let's go check out what's there. I'm pretty sure it's not a good sign. Actually, you know what? Bring my cheesy mod. <laughs> And we can check out the sea. Oh, that's a little too close. Is there a way to slowly look into it? That's the missile launcher. This is the bottom half of the ship. And there's a, there is a turret right over there. So if we head to the top half, I think we should be okay. Hopefully. Let's go check it out. Ooh, we are definitely being shot at. From the bottom half. All right, we are safe here. Um, except for that one turret or two. Ooh, there was two. Okay, I hope. <laughs> I hope our body location is far enough from the turret so I don't get shot at. I'm not. Okay, that's not good sign. Oh, our body location is too close to that turret. So I won't be able to get my equipment in time, which is not great. Ah, shoot. All right, that's not good. Um, we not we might not be able to get our equipment back, which is horrible. <laughs> Um, we need to find a way to shoot it down. I don't remember we have 8P ammo, do we? No. We don't have any mags for that. We only have enough for one. Okay, that's not good. <laughs> We don't have a grinder either. Nope. 
this is not good. We're, mar we're likely going to run, lose our things if we don't get to the weapons in time. Can we make a rocket launcher? <laughs> we could. That's going to work. <laughs> a little excessive, but that's what we're going to do here. I'm going to rocket launcher our thing for if we can even see it. I don't even know where the turret is. Hopefully we don't die. I think it's that one there. Oop. Ouch. Alright, we should be safe this way. That's a little excessive, but it had to be done. <laughs> I don't know if I shot it. Probably didn't. Ow, 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 ow. Which one is shooting me? Oh, there's NPCs. That's not good. And the NPCs are in my way. But is the turret gone? The NPC is going to kill me. I think, oh no! Alright, we're likely gonna lose our stuff, which is not great. Not what I was hoping for. I need my body bag or location. Definitely this side is bad because of that. I need this one right here. Ow. If I can get... Oh, there's nothing in that one. I got about NPCs, so that's a bad sign. If I just could get my body bag or body location, I should be fine, but I'm pretty sure I lost the one I need. That sucks. Right? So it's this one is the one that has nothing. Ow. I might have to go in with my ship, but then the missile launcher is the problem too. All right, so this is not good. If we lose the body location or the bag, uh, we have no grind or anything to salvage the ship, actually. That's definitely a no-go. Jeez. Where are you shooting me from? That's pretty far. Ow. Oof. This is not good. <laughs> I really want to bring my ship in there, but I think we lost our in in inventory stuff too already, so that's not good. Uh, shoot. Did we bring this thing close? Uh, and the missile launcher, we didn't take that out. If we were able to take out the missile launcher, then... Then that would be more helpful. Alright, we're able to get a grinder out, so that's good. Let's just get a grinder. Let's see if we can take out the missile launcher. Definitely lost our body location already, our bag of inventory. We gotta fly away from... Let's just take... Yeah, we just gotta take out the missile launcher. Wherever that is. Right. No, that's not... That's... Artillery. I'll take this out too. Where's the rocket? Ooh. Ow, 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 ow. Did I take out the rocket already? It looks like it did. Do we risk it now? Actually, don't even know if we took out the rocket or not, but I think potentially we did. Let's just see by flying close to it. We might have already oop taken it out. Ooh. A lot of smaller turrets that are in my way. Uh nope, the rocket's right there. We did not take that out. They're so accurate with their firearms. I 
All right, if I could take out, ooh, get away from me. If we take this out, we're good to go. We'll come in hot with our ship. And that's what we're gonna do. <laughs> I'm gonna target weapons and, well, let's target people first. I think that's probably the best way to go about it. Yeah, we lost our grinder and everything. At least we got another grinder. That's good, good, good enough. All right, so our turrets. We need to do target characters, enemies, and weapons. I think does that hit? Does that hit the people if I do that? I'm not sure. Let's get close, but not too too close. I think the interior turret's at 600, so we can get fairly close. And hopefully that works out. All right, so we're about, let's get up to 600. We were only targeting weapons, hopefully. Of course, they need to be on. Well, they are on, okay. Nope, they're not on. Turn them on in a second. I think these are my scraps right here in front. I don't think they're gonna shoot us just yet. Those in interior turrets, All right? So we're close enough. So. Dude, I can't believe we lost a lot of stuff. It's all right. Turn that on. And I don't think we have interior. We don't have any shells, right? Where is that NPC? <laughs> We're on the safe side too, which is on the interior turrets right there, I think. I think that should have knocked that out, right? Fine, another one just in case, but I think we, we, we should be good. Mm. Doesn't look like we took it out. I have to get closer. That's very close. All right, Gatlin's shooting something. All right, don't we have a Gatlin that we control? That firing at the person? Yes, it is. Firing at the NPC. That NPC is quite nimble. All right. Hit it once. Twice. Not easy to aim at it. I think I hit it a couple of times. I'm not sure if I killed it. Nope, still moving. How many shots does it take? <laughs> Alright, I don't see our interior turrets right there. Take that out. Alright, good. That's taken out. We'll let that deal with it. Uh, we need a weapon because we need to fire at this stupid thing. <laughs> We lost our rocket launcher too and our rockets, so that's great. Uh, M30? No. Uh, M50. Let's do M50. Can we make the ammo for it? We need magnesium powder. So, what's going to give us magnesium powder? Maybe a few of these things? 
that's that's what we gotta work with right now. We have no other choice. And weapons. Yeah, we definitely lost all our gear. Yep, they're gone. That's great. All right, we gotta find the NPC. I think we're safe in terms of the ship itself. We just gotta find the NPC, which is right there. Looks like. So we're gonna go to war now. Oh, he's such a good shot. Sounds like my ship is shooting at it. Did it? He's still alive. Another NPC. Ow. Ow. Why is this thing such a good shot? <laughs> we got a Reaver Slayer coming our way as well. That's not good. Ah, jeez. We're going to run out of ammo soon. Hopefully the Reaver Slayer doesn't detect us, but it looks like it might be headed our way a little bit. So we can probably gather what we can gather from this ship really quickly. Let's see what's there. Um, make a run for it. If we need to. We don't, have a, we don't have a grinder. Great. Oh, we do have a grinder. We just need... Put the two on first. <laughs> totally forgot about NPCs inside. Alright, I'm gonna keep this point. This is the a wreckage. Ooh, definitely didn't mean to do that. Uh, so much sensors in here, which makes it alarming. Trying to see if there's any goodies. Where is it? It's at. Trying to see if there's any reactors here. Doesn't look like it. The Reaver is still closing in on us. Not good. I think the NPCs are dead now, right? Looks like it. Ow! Nope. I was wrong. What shot us? I have no idea. Right, I'm gonna fly closer and low. Is the Reaver Slayer pretty close? Oh no, we got detected. That means we're gonna have to jump and go elsewhere for now. Let me get my stuff really quick if I can. Okay. Doesn't look like we're going to be able to get our stuff. If this is our things right here. We might be getting it next to the door. I don't think we have time. Reaver is right on our butt. Nope, we have time. No time. No time. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Turn the shield on. Ouch. I don't know if I turn the shield on just in time or not, but we got to go. We got to go. We, did we do a blind jump. Probably don't need to do that. Um, I don't know. We might not be able to outrun it for sure. But this is definitely not good. Alright, so we lost a lot of our materials. We're going to just free fly away for now. Ooh, okay, not good. We just need a grinder. Okay, we're good with a grinder. We have bottles, I think. So we should be okay. Yeah, we have bottles. Ah, this has this is definitely not good. We have no weapons. The rocket launcher was a good idea, but don't have that anymore. The ship may or may not survive that. Oh, that ship over there. We lost a lot of gear. That's bad. All right, turn the shields off. Luckily, we did do a little bit of um. GPS pointer over there. I don't know if I turn the shields on just in time for whatever shot me. And I think I did because I don't see much damage in the back. I might have taken a little bit of a 
a shot. I think. I don't see any damage, so that's good. I mean, can we look out? We can look in here to see if they're incomplete speed mods only. Oh, we have some speed mods completed. Interesting. When did I do that? <laughs> Are we away from it? Away from it? I want to say I hope so. Where is that wreckage? DPS. If I fly that way, is the Reaver still there? <laughs> could be. Definitely could be. But I think we're safe. It, it's gone. Flew away from it. But uh, if I fly it towards it, I'm pretty sure it's going to come back and show my radar. If that does happen, I'm going to have to pop the shields on really quickly. I hope that's not the case, though. <laughs> Jeez, why is it every time I get near a ship, there's got to be a reaver to show up? Oh, my antenna was on because I kept on respawning. Is that what it was? Oh, yeah, the reaver's still there. All right, that's not a good sign. That reaver's just hanging out there. I might have to speed it through that base over there if I can. I'm going to pop the shields on. Just unfortunate I don't have enough power or ammo to fight a reaver. But I'm trying to head towards the, the beacon right now to be on the safety bubble. And I'll come back for this wreckage later down the line if I need to. But for now I can't do much. That's the unfortunate part. And it's a small ship too. They don't have the firepower to fight a small ship. It's just it's just ridiculous, to be honest. It's just floating around there. It's not it's not. Yes, yeah, it should be flying away. We're just staying there for now. Not much we can do about it, unfortunately. So we're just gonna land the SPSL station for now. Very unfortunate. <laughs> There's a nice little ship to start gathering stuff out of it. But we gotta, we gotta, yeah, this is all we can do is just fly away, unfortunately. Five minutes left in my batteries for this shield. Uh, that's not good. <clears throat> Alright, I think we're safe, so I'm gonna turn off the shield. Who knows if it's gonna stay afloat around there? It may. It may not. But I guess we could just finish off some trading to make some money and then we go back to the other station and get some ammo. Then that way we should feel a little more comfortable with ourselves here. <laughs> Can't believe that wreck ship just pretty much took me out. Took all my old tools and rocket launchers. Uh, I forgot there's NPCs that were shooting us too. And that NPC was very, very, sh very sharp shooting. <laughs> that thing took me out really well. All right, we're about to hit the SPSL station. Turn on now, stuff. Damn. All right, I just feel super defeated. <laughs> Not being able to fight a small ship with shields. That's, yeah, it's just crazy that way. I know some of you have mentioned that um, another weapon that's supposed to go with the defensive shields so that it fights off shields, I think. Something like that. I gotta look into that, but I don't think the original ammo and th things like that's gonna be workable in this setting. I think. Alright, so. Yeah, not much we can do about it. Let's just chill here for now. Oh, this is the... Oh, I thought I read... <laughs> I thought it was in the other sh other station, but I'm in a component selling station. I thought I was in the um, ship selling station so I could sell some stuff, but... Oh, well, that's fine. 825 metal grids. Do we have that much? I think we don't. 
because we sold a lot of those things at one point in time. Sell that. Yeah, we can sell these. It's fine. If we have it. If not, oh well. You can see it says large grid 4579. Don't know why. Uh, we don't have any large grid tubes. I don't think we have that much metal grids. Nope, we don't. That's fine. We can always get more. All right, we need ammo and power. Ammo we have by Gatlin for sure. Rockets would probably work out really well too. But that's only good for shooting something stationary. We could buy explosives. Explosives do have a decent amount of materials for like uranium and such i think oh um, explosive magnesium well not a lot though six seven better than most all right let's get ourselves situated with more hydrogen if we can yeah we can oh, they sell so little it's insane so these are yeah, they all say much. I don't know why the large grid. It says large grid that way. That's so weird. 695 only. <laughs> so little. Oh, there we go. We got Gatlin ammo now. And assault cannon. We ain't buying that much. That's insane. Buy 20. Don't know if I actually bought the 20. Don't look like it did. Fine. <laughs> Ooh, gallon ammo is so expensive. Wow, 100 is going to be all our cash. We'll buy 20. Some hydrogen. Did we buy oxygen instead of hydrogen by mistake? Potentially. That's not good. <laughs> oh, well. I think we're good from there. We don't need our own ammo and everything, do we? Mm, it's always good to have, but just buy an M20. Let's buy two M20s for now. Buy some ammo. Buy ten. Just to keep ourselves ready when we need to. All right, so we gotta see how we can upkeep our shields. Turn this off because that's probably killing our batteries. Is one thing. Ah, we got some uranium. Nice. Well, I think that's for our reactors, right? We got a react. Yeah, we got all that reactor stuff going on. Where's our weapon? Did we even buy it. What's going on? <laughs> I feel like we didn't even buy anything. Did it go in the wrong place? But I just got ripped off. Oh, there's the Reaver. Impaler. That's a different one. Seriously, what happened to my rifle? Didn't I just buy the rifle? Did I not go through? Because it was on the hydrogen tank? Did I just get gypped? <laughs> Hope not. I might have. It looks like it. Uh, can't tell, but... <laughs> MR20 by two, and we said about 10 ammo. There, yeah, I, I don't know if we got ripped off or not, but it's possible. Like, did we even get the assault cannon ammo? Probably not. By 10, I hope that's enough firepower at least to fight the shield. How far can Gatlin guns penetrate the shield, anyways? I have no idea. Like, it probably takes a lot in this case for some reason. All right, we got to situate ourselves again. Uh, put our weapon here. Our tools got to be fixed. Wish I didn't lose that rocket launcher. That was a really nice rocket launcher. Okay, the impaler is over there. I think we should be able to run away for now. Their power says says one day, so that's good. Oh, but I have the shield off. 
I turn it on, it overloaded. What? <laughs> what did I just do? Reaver and Paula is over there. So if I fly backwards, it shouldn't be able to detect us, I think. I hope. <clears throat> Not sure what I did to the shields just now, but it overloaded. Probably because I don't have enough power, or maybe because I'm connected to the, to the base here. Alright, let's unlock. This is really bad, the amount of... um. <laughs> power that I have left on this thing. Actually, if I fly towards the wreck, that's where the Reaver's headed right now. So that's not good. I really did wish I could fight these small ships. <laughs> They're just small ships. They're not large ships. That's the biggest problem I have is fighting these things with my, my current Gatlins is not enough. Wait, how many Gatlins do we even have? It doesn't look like we have much at all. We don't have not we don't have much at all. Why did we render us with so little Gatlins right now? That's not good. <laughs> we definitely need a lot more. We only have two. Interesting. Yeah, we need to get ourselves more offensive because this is not looking good. We need to find more spots with Gatlins and put even um, artillery shells or or even more than that to see if we can get through their shields better. Because right now we, we could barely put a dent on them. The interior turrets in the front they ain't going to do anything either. I am wondering where that Impala is going. Like looking like it's going towards the wreckage. I need to get, I need it to get past the wreckage so I could get to it. That's the ideal part of this. I can slowly get to it now, I think. Hopefully. Why is my shield overloading? Is it because I don't have any power? Or because I'm in this field? I probably don't have much power anyway, so. So it says we have about 37 minutes of power. Well, now it says hours. Strange. Alright, so. If I hit the shield. On, oh, it did nothing. What is going on with my shields? <laughs> overloaded. Why is it overloaded? I don't understand how that works. To be honest. Oh, there it goes. There's a shield. Ooh, the shield's so small on me. Low on fuel. Ooh, five minutes with the shield on. This is looking really bad. <laughs> really, really bad. Alright, I think I can sneak on. Oop. I was about to say we can sneak on by. We have nothing on. How's it detecting us? Alright, now we're gonna get stuck in this station. This is not looking good. I should have waited a little longer. Alright, this is not good. I'm gonna turn this off. I'm gonna just chill in the bubble, I guess. <laughs> All right, cool. So if you're in the bubble, it tends to ignore you. So that's a good sign. Our shield barely fits us, but it's okay. And we don't have not much power with the shield on. It keeps blinking on and off. That's definitely not good. <laughs> I guess these reactors is not enough to recharge ourselves, is it? I mean, if we recharge one battery only, 
it is recharging, so that's a good sign. Right here, yeah. But we are very, very low in power. That's why we need to get that wreckage to get more power. <laughs> <clears throat> Alright, let that fly away for a little bit longer. I think it should be okay. We'll slowly, if it detects us again, we gotta tuck our tails back in <laughs> and fly back to the space station here or beacon. Yeah, but I have no antennas on, no nothing, so I'm not sure why it detected us in the beginning while we just left. Hopefully the other reaver is not there anymore. The reaver just stopped. This is like baiting me. <laughs> if I fly further away from it, we should be okay. Um, we got a little bit more ammo now, so we should be okay. Um, let me get rid of that ship DPS pointer. Now, we could easily lock the wreckage into our ship and bring it back, and then we'll decide what to do with it. Or we just scrap it for parts. Um, it's pretty significantly damaged by what I did to it, so maybe we just scrap it for parts. Because it might not be a salvage salvageable ship that we can assimilate to ours. If it is, then yeah, I'll definitely attach it. But we'll, we'll see once we get close to see what's looking, what's it looking like. Um, hopefully all the NPCs are dead too, but I doubt they are. So, threat avoid it when it comes to <laughs> the, uh, what's it may call it? The Reaver. The Reaver might have even attacked it, who knows. If it did, it probably split the whole ship in half. I mean, it's looking okay. I don't see anything too crazy about it. Yeah, it's still intact. I don't know what's still intact though. It might still be an interior turret that's intact, so it might shoot us a bit. But that shouldn't cause significant damage, hopefully. And hopefully everything is just peaceful when I get to it. <laughs> Alright, we gotta slow down. All right, about, we're gonna hit 600, so if anything's gonna shoot us, it's pretty much now. Looks like we're highlighting a weapon, maybe. Might be on the other side of the ship. And the NPCs? I think the NPCs are gone. I hope so, at least. Seems like that may be the case. I don't hear any shooting. At all. Alright, let's see if we stop right here. Something just turned off. <laughs> Are there any NPCs around? Doesn't look like it's a lot of scrap. We can... Oof. Yeah, this thing is not... I don't think it's salvageable to the point that I can attach it to my ship. So, I might just scrap it for parts if I can. This is a lot of materials right over here. That's great. I feel like we could get this ship a little bit closer. And if we put welders on the ship, even better. But at this moment, I don't think that's going to be possible. I'm pretty sure there's a still turret somewhere on the other side. I'm not sure what my ship is aiming at, but we'll take a look. After we gather, after we get the rest of this field emitter. It looks like we're not getting shot at, so it's Looking good. All right, shield emitters are great because it has a lot of materials. Steel plates also great for us to have. This thing may not have any more power. Potentially. If I scrap all its power too, then we, we won't be shot at. That's a lot of batteries.
I think this thing either I shot at it pretty badly or the Reaver may have passed on by as well and shot it decent amount because it looks a lot more damaged than when I left it to be honest or my shooting of the rocket launchers and everything like that did a number on it as well my ship could have done a number on it as well too um we'll just jump on this side i don't hear any shooting all right we're, we're good i think we're safe um everything's like gone did he ice net nope yeah this thing is pretty destroyed We'll just scrap it for parts. That's all the best we can do with this. Alright, we scrapped as much as we can off the wreckage as you see here. It's just a bunch of scraps left to collect, if anything. <laughs> um, not the easiest thing to collect by just looking at it, but I think there's a decent amount of scrap though. So I think maybe the Reaver did pass by and shoot it a little bit and then left, potentially. Or all the damage from my Gatlins and everything like that, potentially. Interesting, what is this? Canvas. <laughs> Alright, so that's pretty much it. It's just little scraps here and there. So we should have a lot of materials from this salvage, basically. But again, not the funnest thing to do when you can't battle even a small reaver. <laughs> it's quite sad, actually, but definitely not something I can do anything about because of the shields. If we didn't have shields, maybe it'd be easier. I mean, I probably would still also lose a decent chunk of my ship from fighting a Reaver. Only because. Alright, so let's head back to the RTCG station, which is the... Actually, no, we should head back to the um, SPSL station. So we can buy hydrogen constantly if we need to. And it looks like we probably do need to. I think this is the, the base that's not in the planet, right? Yeah, that one's just outside, so that's fine. Yeah, we definitely need to buy more hydrogen so we can turn the power hydrogen engine on to power up our batteries. Um, our small reactors ain't doing squat, so that's another thing. <laughs> if it was doing better, then I wouldn't worry too much about the uranium that we have and everything like that in the power situation. But the small reactors that we have, I think we had like six of them. Ain't It ain't doing too much. It's doing a number, it's doing decently to our batteries, but still not that great. 
It's not enough to power our shields, at least. So we definitely need a regular small reactor, which is going to require like 100 reactor components, which I don't have. And a bit difficult to acquire, too. So we de we're definitely going to edit the ship a little bit for solar panels as one, well, just to get that extra power out of it. And what else? Um, yeah, it's just more power management, more weapons, definitely more weapons for sure. I'm not sure how much it's going to take to actually penetrate shields, but we're going to have to find that out sooner or later by setting up this whole ship with tons and tons of um, assault cannons, gatlins, things like that. We might even do a custom turret that has um, auto cannons. I think auto cannons will help too. Hopefully. But if all that doesn't work out too well with the shields, we, we would have to look into um, turning them off or maybe look at the other thing. I think it's called weapon core. You, somebody mentioned in the comment section. So maybe I, I have to use that together um, with this. Ooh, <laughs> with this combination of um, things. All right. So that was a bit of a hit there. <laughs> Where is the side connector? I know it's around here somewhere. I think what I'm going to do with the turret, the one on above our head, I'm going to do a custom one. So that way I can aim for, for myself if I need to. So right over here, I'm probably going to do a custom one. So we can aim at it. Um, and we can use the cockpit down here as the battle stations if that need be. But this way I can shoot when I want to shoot. In that sense. So hopefully that kind of works out. But yeah. Once again. It just sucks. Because I feel so defeated by not being able to fight a small ship. Like the, the small reaver ship. It just makes no sense to me. <laughs> Alright. Hydrogen is so limited in terms of buy. Okay. Now we have a lot more. So it's about 6,000. Which should be the 6 mil of him. Which is still not enough to fill all our tanks it looks like yeah it's not even if I bought all of it on this one here oh they fixed it it updated automatically perfect <laughs> that wasn't the case back then but yeah I could buy ammo I wonder how much artillery will sh shoot down a shield like I, I need to test these things I think <laughs> to make sure now react opponents aren't costing me too much here so if I buy this we have a hundred and we, of course we lose out on some, but that's fine. We'll buy a little bit more Gatlin turrets, uh, Gatlin ammo to break it down. We can sell, interesting, we sell gold. <laughs> and uranium, which we can't do that. All right, that's fine. We got a decent amount of stuff to work with. Um, we could build, I think, our small reactor now, hopefully. Let's try. I think that's going to help us power up the ship a lot better than the small ones. Although we don't really have too much uranium anyways. Um, not a lot of spots for a reactor. But we put it right up here. Yeah, we can do that. That means we got to unlock. Fly off to the distance. Ever so slightly. And actually, did we even buy it? Because... Ugh, We keep doing this. Did I lose my money? <laughs> I might as I think I did. That's not good. Um, so what happened is basically I bought reactors. I don't know if it reduced my funds or not, but I bought reactors on my hydrogen tank. So it didn't flow over to it. But did I lose the cash from doing that? I'm not too sure at the moment. We'll see it when in post, but yeah, I don't think it did. All right, there we go. I don't think it did at all, but I hope not. We have enough for a small reactor, which is perfect. We'll throw it here. Like so. And that should definitely help us recharge a lot faster. Is this? Yeah. 15 megawatts instead of your 5 kilowatts here or 500 that should work a lot better so we can get rid of these if we need be 
which probably sounds like a, the best idea. So we have a nice reactor going. I would hope this will start charging up, charging a lot better now. Um, the hydrogen engine, how much does that output? Five. So we could turn this one off. And it should be still charged up pretty well. There we go. Yeah, we are getting a lot more into this thing here. So two would be probably better. Um, if we can do two. We have eight uranium. So it's not a lot of uranium. We could probably get two. Let's just do that. We need the power anyways. So might as well spend on it. And we can sell a lot of materials too because we have a lot. So reactor components right here. We just gotta buy. We have 15, so we can buy 85. Close enough. We'll throw that there. Build that up. Let's split the uranium. We'll put four here. There we go. So that should be a lot more power. I cut it by half. Instead of two hours, we got one hour. Perfect. Now, securing this would be an ideal thing to do. Because it's currently sitting somewhere around there. Near that one block. So it's under... This block right here so we should be okay yeah i was thinking of putting some like heavy armors in certain areas that might be one of them to be honest if we want to make it secure now how fast will it eat the uranium I'm not too sure um and how much stuff can we get rid of in this case so let's go through our inventory really quickly with our large car container right here Okay, so we have a decent amount of stuff here, actually. Yeah. Tons of fuel emitters, which we don't need. We can just get rid of, like, 400 or so. Or even more. But this is going to give us platinum, iron, silicate, and gold, which is great. So let's just do that. So we're going to dock in here, um, return some acquisitions... Get as much money as we can, refuel as much as we can as well. So metal grids looks like we have enough. I hope this was the station where I did the contracts. <laughs> if not, then uh, that's gonna stink. Yeah, it was here. We finish this one off because we have enough. We don't have enough large steel too, so we gotta produce some. And we can sell a load of this stuff here. If we want to make the funds for it. Do we need to sell? We don't necessarily need to. Should we? Probably. Because we need some funding. <laughs> and there's some stuff that we don't really need. I mean, like, detective components. We don't really need that. So we could sell all of it. I mean, does that make us money? Not really. I mean, acquisitions sometimes are a little bit better in this case. Not always, though. The rest of the components are hard to get by. But wow. You sell for that much. I think I have some. Actually, no, I don't. Do I have any? I do. Yeah, that's about a mil right there, so that's good to sell. You want to sell other things? They're too cheap to sell is the problem. Yeah, definitely too cheap to sell. So, I mean, we got some of these. We could dismantle them and get better parts out of them instead of selling it, but... Like I said, it's not much money anyways. 88, so that's not worth it. This is not worth it. None of this is really worth it. It's more of the acquisition that's more worth it, to be honest. So, that's how we should make our funds from. I'm glad we got more power, so that's good. I wonder if we can do repair contracts sooner or later. They're, they're pretty decent in terms of funding, but how much materials do we need to repair something? That's another question. Falling will always bring us to another station, which is great, but that one's way too far. So if there's a shorter route one, I definitely would take it. <laughs> but for now, 
we gotta do some inventory management to see what we can get rid of what we can keep yeah everything is recharging basically um actually you know what what if we did this take all our batteries i can't believe we lost our ion scout to be honest <laughs> we gotta do recharge I mean, just do everything on recharge for now. Should be okay. All right, so that way we have enough power with the recharging of our reactors. Um, again, how fast is it eating up the uranium? Pretty quickly, actually. So we're gonna run out of that fairly quickly, but we have a lot of this other stuff here. Uh, small steel tubes could produce some. We're dismantling off this one. So this one we do. Let's just do a thousand of it. We have a lot of gold from the superconductors. So that's good. Uh, gravity components. There's a lot of things we could dismantle. Uh, I guess. Well, gravity components. Silver and gold cobalt. Okay, so that's worth dismantling as well. We don't necessarily need it right now, unless we want to make a, a fish tank, <laughs> which needs only one. But all the rest we could dismantle for part. I think we should be able to do that. None of these have magnesium, which is the worst part of things. Gatlin ammo. We got to buy a ton of Gatlin ammo for magnesium if we need to do that. Yeah, that seems to be the case. But this is giving us a lot of silicon, gold, iron, and platinum. So that's good. Because a filmmitter, yeah, that's a lot of iron. A lot of gold, too. So we need to sell gold, we can sell gold. We definitely ain't going to do another jump drive because we ain't got enough power for that. We could load this thing up with more batteries if need be. I mean, right here is a good prime spot for batteries on both ends. We could do four more batteries. Do we want to do that? Probably. That we need to produce a little bit more power cells. I think we only got 61 power cells. After this, we'll make 300 of these. Could be less than that, but that's fine. That's gonna take forever to produce because it doesn't have speed bots. Uh, fuel mill is gonna take forever to take down as well. Can't believe I have so much bottles. <laughs> we should make extra grinders if we can, just in case we get ourselves killed again. I'm just going to keep a few. We need a binocular as well. Weapon wise, again, we don't really have much to do with that. We need to buy uranium. That's what we need. Okay, so this ship is going to power up. We're going to leave it here for a little bit. And I guess the next iteration is going to be to keep it powered for the shields and then arm this thing like crazy. That's what's going to bring up in the next few episodes. Hope you guys enjoyed this series so far. If you did, like and subscribe down below. Don't forget to leave a comment. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.